Hi, thanks for watching my video. What you see here is my cat's Raspberry Pi controlled with a robot. I realize that everybody knows what a Raspberry Pi is. A Raspberry Pi is a small credit card sized computer that operates on the Linux operating system. The Raspberry Pi computer is capable of monitoring and controlling external devices. In order to integrate the Raspberry Pi computer, into my cat's litter robot, I had to first learn how the litter robot worked. I took it apart and analyzed the circuitry. I then created a prototype that consisted of a few electronic components and a computer program that I wrote in a programming language called Perl. Once I had the system fully operational, I put all of the hardware in an enclosure. This is the litter robot circuit board that once controlled the litter robot. This is usually mounted here. And this is the Raspberry Pi computer. Connected to this, I have a uh, Wi Fi dongle. You'll notice all of these pins up here on this back side of the circuit card. Those pins can be used to control devices with. In order to make the integration easier, I connected all of the sensors and the motor to an external wire that comes out of the litter robot. I use an RS-232 cable and all that does that connects to the interface card here. For the purpose of the video, I set the cat delay from 10 minutes to 20 seconds. As you can see here, the red light's blinking. That's the heartbeat that shows that the software program is running. When I press on the cat sensor, the green light turns on. It tells the system that the cat has used the litter box. Usually there's a delay for 10 minutes before it starts the cleaning cycle. But for the purpose of the demo, I set it to 20 seconds. So the cycle should start here in just a second. Here we go. So now the red light flashes at a very fast rate when the system's actually doing the cleaning cycle. Also, you can see here from the computer, this is the log file that gets generated. So the process has gone through the cat sensor, the cycle started. And at the present time, it's waiting for the dump switch detection. So that is when the litter robot gets to the part where the clumps are dumped into the lower basket here at this point. So at this point, the litter robot is going to put the litter back. When the process is completed, I have the Raspberry Pi configured so it will upload the cycle time to my cat's Twitter account.
So that's it, the cleaning process has completed. The green light's turned off. Now there should be a slow red blinking light. This is my cat's Twitter webpage. And as you can see, the last cycle just got posted. It's got the cycle number, the time that the cat entered and exit the litter robot, and the cleaning cycle times. So I hope you like the Raspberry Pi Litter Robot. Thanks for watching.